Goku yeah. and the Peach player. Of course, right. both players really gifted in both of their character choices. I would love to see a lot of more combo kind of combinations coming in from uh, Kappus. But let's see as we get into the first match. Right, Again, feeling each other out here with some projectiles early. Yeah, I was looking at McBenedict's match earlier against Gimmicks, and he does he does play heavily heavily in the early game Hadoukens, trying to feel out the character, trying to feel out his opponent just a little bit. Well, uh, it's important to in. kind of gauge how your important wants to space. What parts of the stage are their favorite? You know. Absolutely, absolutely, and of course, playing that more passive gameplay, respecting their opponent just a little bit more, just trying to feel them out before going in all in. Very smart choice in gameplay, but. Of course, we do love to see that action-packed game. Play. It's true, it's true, and you know, that, that whole moment of, of kind of feeling each other out is really crucial because that's how you kind of figure out what openers uh, your opponent prefers, and based on those openers, you kind of can feel on what combos they're more confident. For sure, for sure, and, and of course, you, you have that conditioning kind of like mental game putting into this gameplay aspect as well. This, of course, Smash is a really great game. Uh, really conditioning, trying to condition, understand what your opponent is trying to do in really stressful situations. So Right, and if you can counter one of their strongest uh, preferences, then you're forcing them to play off game, which is really huge in uh, a game like Smash, which is really confident based. But as we're speaking here, Sea Devil taking a bunch of damage. Cap is Yeah, Cap is on, on this Peach already at kill percent at this point. Of course, I would like to see a more jab-jab combo oriented kill confirm, or maybe a random up smash or a side smash, but we'll see what happens as McBenedict tries to get this kill. Of course, McBenedict also at kill percent as well. That's going to be a jab jab into it, roundhouse kick. That's going to be the stock. Right. Called out 100%. Called out. And but of course, he's going to need to take this soon. Kappas is definitely going to need to close out the 2-2. Oh, an unfortunate SD as trying to recover that. back onto the stage. McBenedict not getting the recovery option that he actually wanted. Right, but that's how we get the close match. Don't forget. Oh, for sure. We take those. We take those types of stocks. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. No homie stocks out here. No homie stocks out here. It's already loser semis. So, of course, both players at their wits and trying to feel out what they want to do, how they're going to take the advantage in this match. Right. Loser. I, may, may, I mean, they might be going home or they might be sitting around for another Of game. course, of course. <laughs> and of course, both players at 50, 60%, both at two socks. Ryu right. already at the ledge, going in for the roundhouse kick again. Not converting into anything else other yeah, than that. Yeah, they're really heavily playing the edges here, but I mean, it's funny I say that and they start playing the neutral in the middle of the stage. You know? For sure, like for sure. My mind. Yeah, I mean, stage control is a very important aspect to this game as well. You can see both players fighting for that center stage as Peach is getting a little bit more into that kill percentage state. Another random smash or a, a combo or a up tilt from mm. down, I think that was what it was. That's gonna be gonna. That's gonna do it for the stock. It the was uppercut. definitely ruthless, but 76% on Ryu means Peach has some serious damage to do before uh, we're looking at a one-one situation. Yeah, not too drastically to overcome. Not not too bad of a feat to overcome. We can see that grab coming in down the down throw into the up air. Not mm. quite able to convert that stitch face though. She's gonna get lucky getting it, but not quite able to do anything. It's irrelevant though, but. These combos are just going to connect. For sure, that Hadouken from offstage is going to connect. That throw, he got a little bit too greedy with the pummels. Not able to throw it after that. That's going to be a jab into a combo. The kick is coming through. But Ryu is still at kill percent. I mean, how is right, Kappa going to close out the stock? You know, it's. I think at this point, Ryu is just trying to pepper as much. But as we say that, now it's going to go down to a 1-1 one, one stock situation. But Ryu playing the edge real nice here with only a 0%. This is real rough for Kappas, but just like we saw La Kappas' last match, you know, it's possible to come back from this percentage. Absolutely, it's so possible, especially if you have like such a mastery on this character. You can see Peach already offstage, but already gaining center control here. Kappas, let's see if you can bring this back. The Hadouken's gonna hit you in the face, but what's gonna be, what's it gonna be for the kill option from Ryu? Oh. Mick Benedict actually closing it out with the Shoryuken. Oh, that's funny, my computer died finally. Oh, fuck it, man. <laughs> That's going to be Benedict wow. getting the first round. Very surprisingly, I mean, the, 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 the beginning of the match was fairly even, fairly passive gameplay. Both players trying to feel each other out. But more aggressive gameplay obviously coming in as the time was running down. But I mean, we'll see how uh, Kappas actually brings this and back. And Ryu, Ryu can close the gap really well. I mean, Peach is definitely not bad at doing it either. But yep. when you're talking about getting through small cracks and attacks, it's... 
Ryu all the way there. So yeah, of course. The edge there at the end. Also, trying to use that turn up to your advantage. A lot of the combos that you try to bring off of Peach are very mechanically driven. So if you don't have those combos locked down, those down tilts into whatever turn up combo you can get, it's very hard to capitalize on such a small window. Right. Whenever it comes to playing against Mr. Benedict. Right, and we have seen uh, not honestly very many turnip conversions, you know, mm -hmm. get a get a turnip and actually start a combo from it. Right, it's more just like throw the turnip, try to see what I can do. I don't know what much I can get else from this conversion, but it's actually playing very right. nicely in his favor. No, that actually was a, a really smart play to throw the stitch up top to force the player down bottom, mm -hmm. you know, being able to force the player into a spot to confirm and guarantee a combo is Definitely the play here, but absolutely going into map or stage two. Sorry, forgive me and my verbiage, but going into stage two, it's wow, honestly, pretty close again. This is how the last uh, the last game started. Yeah, I mean, oh, you can see a lot of Hadoukens, a lot of turnups coming in through. I mean, Ryu's already at kill percent at this point. Not gonna do it necessarily, but the turnups gonna be giving him some trouble getting back on the stage, not right. getting him, not two framing him off onto the ledge. But we'll see what the kill option is coming out from Mr. Uh, Cap is coming in here. Toad helping the girl out. Toad helping the girl out. I mean, you got to help out the girl with, uh, with those throws, you know? <laughs> it's true. Look, yeah. castles can't oh. take care of themselves. And, and also, just Miss McBenedict already at full rage, being able to... Uh, there it is, the two stock already. I mean, both players fair, at a fairly even uh, Just point wiping right a stock away. Just wiping a stock away. Just wiping away. it away. Pretending you started 2-2, two -two, you know? Yeah, pretty much. A clean slate coming in for both of these players. 25%, close to a 12%, only a 10% differential. But slowly making that increase uh, differential happen even more. Yeah, Ryu's in kind of a... Oh, oh. no! I don't want to see the disrespect anymore! Oh. Ryu, Mick Benedict actually getting the, the spike on the spike. down air. Oh my off goodness. The stage. If I was Get off my stage. If I was Capus right now, I'd be very tilted at this point. But you can see Cap is already bringing it back to 47%. Even though it's his, it's his last stock, Mick Benedict, 57%, can... You do it more, it's 80% 80, 80 already, almost kill percent at this point, already off stage, but not necessarily getting anything after that. That's gonna be a focus. Nothing converting after that. A lot of a lot of stage control coming in. Yeah, holding the edges. That's all Peach really can do here at this moment is just finish that kill. And she needs to so bad. This yep. is a huge stage for her. Cap is saying that down air spike you did to me off stage does not mean anything. Bringing it back to a one stock situation here. McBenedict versus Capus. Here we I go. I cannot stress enough how much Peach needs this stock, though. We have to go 1-1. One, one. Absolutely. It's very I mean, possible we're going to see a sweep otherwise. Yep. I mean, 73% to 33%. I mean, it's a fairly close and even matchup we have here. Let's see if Capus can actually bring it back. That's going to be sure you can getting onto shield, not necessarily breaking it. Yeah, Cap is playing really smart reads there on the defense while also still being able to put out some of her own attacks. Up air coming through, more up air chains coming through. Oh, the Keeping percentage him, neck and neck. Keep here. him in the air, forward air. Of course, you already kicked. You can't recover any other option, but the sure you can. Do not let the man get back on the stage. Exactly. Ryu holding happens. this neutral in the middle of the map. He seems pretty comfortable there. It looks like. <gasps> oh. Oh man, that's such a scary moment. It's really great options we're seeing from Peach. The forward air is going to connect that's and it's going right. to bring it to a one to one situation Slaps here. Slaps him off the stage. Slaps him. Oh man, that daunting. And you can see the relief in Capus' eyes too. <laughs> that was probably the biggest sigh I've seen tonight. Yep, Cap is understanding, hey, coming back from that spike specifically. Right. To me, I would be tilted after that. I wouldn't even want to play no, the game. No, that's anymore. actually huge uh, too because. And Ryu was at such a low percentage when he got that spike off to go 2-1. Yeah, exactly, so. exactly. He had that uh, stock advantage, but the, but being able to take it back, a, a very good moral boost. And that coming says a lot, too, about the momentum coming in here to this next stage is we're going to take it back to Pokemon Stadium mm -hmm. because, again, this game is so big on confidence factor that if you win this map and you take it into the final stage, or is do you, is loser still rise best of five? I'm actually not too sure if it's going to be best of five or best of three, but I mean we'll see. I guess we're going to find out, like. right? Either yeah. way, taking this advantage here in the set is going to be mm -hmm. really big. Exactly. I mean, Peach Cap is already bringing Ryu back off stage. Let's see what the option is going to be. I think that's Peach's most comfortable position, you know. So if Peach can just keep playing Ooh. this and keep conditioning to stay off the. Oh, that's my God. a beautiful turn up coming in. Two to three turnouts hitting, connecting him to offstage, pretty much keeping 
Capis uh, McBenedict's recovery options out. I'm gonna tell you those those turnips connected like Wi-Fi for sure. Yep, that I love good. the I love the connection. Such a strong connection. Love the Wi-Fi, almost like fiber. Here Dude, we go. I'm on four bars. Four bars, man. <laughs> I wish I had four bars at this point, but, but we know those turnips had four bars. Oh, oh for absolutely, sure. absolutely. There's gonna be a down throw into a back air. Nothing happening yeah, after and that. Yeah, Peach staying alive here too in this first stock is so yes. big. Capitalizing on a three stock lead, not being able to take off that stock, that's going to be a counter coming in. Right, 73% Ryu is just doing yes. his best to close out this first stock. I love to see this gameplay coming in from Capus, playing very a lot more aggressively, understanding the opponent a little bit more. But Benedict just trying to throw out a lot of different moves, not necessarily being able to take the stock, but, but as I say that, that's going to be a stock. Finally closing out that stock, but that's going to be real rough as he's going to be 107% behind. 100% already. I mean, already at kill percent at this point. Let's Ryu, see what the Ryu's hoping for an early catch. Maybe playing the edge of the stage for an early spike would be a good play here. Yep, may possibly. But I mean, of course, another jab jab combo coming in. The down air sending him straight into the right side of the stage. More turnips. Gotta be scared of those Once turnips. Once again, comfortable spot for Peach, you know. Ooh, I love the edge guard situation that Peach brought out. Yeah, she loves to be here. We we have literally been seeing this the last yep. five minutes, just nonstop damage from that one. Edge. In fact, I would even argue the right ledge is better for Capus than the left. Oh, yeah. Ledge. Seems like she's playing better on the right ledge. Actually. Yep. Not too arbitrary for Capus at this oh, point. Right. I mean, we see a lot of great gameplay, a lot of center stage control already coming in from McBenedict trying to get center stage, trying to close out this stock and make this game a little bit more even, but not necessarily doing that in any case at all. Oh, man. And, and see, the thing about being Ryu at this point is that you cannot take trades. Mm -hmm. You can only take positives. It's, right. it's an unfortunate situation to be in because right now Peach can literally go one for one and take the win. Yeah, absolutely. We saw that random sports but, match coming in for Peach with the golf club, but doesn't necessarily connect. And I believe that was the short you can to actually close out the stock. Yeah, and it's a different position from last stock as Ryu was at 107% on the last stock. Now only a 60% discrepancy. Yep. This is much more capable of coming back. We need to see if Capus can hold this out. Yep, yeah, Benedict bringing it back to a closer game. The parry comes through, jabs into a forward tilt. I think the Hadouken is connect. not quite connected. No. Peach, Peach knows about that trick. Absolutely. The, 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 you, you see a lot more projectiles coming in. We both know, these players know that it's the last stock situation. Yeah, Ryu's trying to get some range. You can tell. Part of those projectiles is like, get away from me, you know what I mean? <laughs> but Peach is not having any of it as closing the gap is definitely the play here. Exactly. The pressure is coming in for both. The down tilt coming in, not getting into anything after that. More up tilts. Keeping Ryu in the air is a good option. It's, I would say, the best option. The best option. 120%. Right. Oh, a oh that was close. Gimmer must be proud right now. All right. <laughs> Here we go. What's going to be the option? Another random force smash. Oh, uh, capitalizing on that yep. forward smash. Getting too. a little bit too antsy on the forward smash as he really wants to close out the stock against Right, that Peach. was a heavy read that didn't quite connect. And Not at all. At 147% at this point, you're you're betting on a oh, money maker, but that's going to be the back air closing it out, bringing Woo. the game cap is 2 to 1. Closing out the heart. Cap is 2 and 0 oh on this stage on Pokémon Stadium. Oh, that's right. That's right. So, wow. Loses the first stage, but uh, taking second stage and yeah, I mean we we both saw really great gameplay coming in from no, both. No, that was players. really good actually. And Capis uh, really capitalizing after that tilting down air spike. I mean, really great gameplay, but of course we're gonna be bringing it. How about up that to comeback on 